what's going on guys and welcome back to the channel and for today i am going to show you how you can connect to an api in wordpress so let's have it okay so first here i am in my dashboard in wordpress and all you have to do is go to your plugins and from here click on add new plugin and here we are going to search for wp get api so once you see this plugin you can click on install now now after that you can click on activate now here the plugin is activated so we can see it down here w get api so let's go ahead and click on api setup and we are going to be taken into this page so this is going to be the setup page for wp get api now first let's give our api a name so for this one let's use the word codable and we need to give it a unique id uh, codable and then it's a new and here for the base url let's go to github and here we can see the website or the base url for codable so let's go ahead and scroll down and copy the api server right here so let's click on copy and let's paste it on base url right here now after that you are going to click on save and it is going to save your setup now we notice that there is another tab here that is available now and this is called codable now this is actually our api and we need to configure the endpoint in here so right here we are going to give it a unique id so say for example we're going to give this an id of let's say new codable and for the endpoint let's go back to the website and let's look at our api references so we want to get random codes so let's go ahead and click on this one get random codes and we are going to find all the information that we need from here now after that what we need to do is copy the endpoint so this is the information after the method which is get so let's go ahead and copy this one in this case it's a slash random so we're going to copy this one and paste it in this endpoint in here now the method here is get this is what the website says here so the method should be get so in our api page we need to choose the get method right here so for the format json string is all right and actually you don't have to change anything in here now after that just click on save so after that you are going to see that you are given a template a tag right here and you are also given a short code right here now here we can go ahead and copy this short code and we are going to paste it in a new page so let's go ahead and hover to pages and click on add new page all right so for now let's close this one let's just add a blank page and let's add the title so here we can give this a title of quotes and then let's click on the plus icon right here to add a block and let's click on short code okay so after that you can just paste your short code in here and click on publish all right so there you have it guys this is how you can connect to api using your wordpress i hope this video is helpful for you thank you so much for watching and i will see you on the next one